tuning in to Dale's Short Hot Topics. And today, we're going to talk about doppelgangers. So you know how sometimes you have a doppelganger, but they normally are not your siblings or anything. Because most of the time, they already are going to have your same characteristics if you have the same mom and dad. But for Ja Rule, it's his son. His son looks more like him than he does. And not trying to be funny. It's like the wife had no parts in having her son except just to carry him. And then push him out on that grand day. It's so uncanny. You know how people look like they parents here and there. But you could tell that's a little difference. But with this, this is his true doppelganger. You cannot tell the difference. Someone even commented, that don't make no dang sense. You guys look at them closely and tell me if you see a difference down in the comments below. Next, we have Pretty Ricky's Baby Blue. He was sentenced to prison for almost two years over a PPP loan scam. That's kind of shocking because everybody else that I've heard of that has been getting sentenced to prison or whatever for PPP loan scams have been getting over five years and stuff for that. And here he comes out with a measly 20 months. So he was arrested a late last year for using his relief to money to fund a luxury lifestyle and splurging on a $96,000 Ferrari. So a Blue and this guy named Tony C. Johnson were charged in getting a whole $24 million relief fraud scheme. And the duo faced charges like wire fraud, bank fraud, conspiracy to commit wire fraud and bank fraud. Wait, just wait. It's a lot. And maybe he didn't get that much because it was him, that guy I mentioned, and 11 other defendants. And then after doing more research, he has to do 20 months in prison for his involvement. And he was ordered to pay $1 million. $111,345.23 in restitution and another a million and something dollars in, in forfeiture in addition to his term of imprisonment. And I believe by himself he had like four charges. But anyways... He still has other things going on in his life. Y'all remember that time he was at that bowling alley and he was like kind of like having an album release party and everything and then he got shot up or when they were outside it was a shooting going on. Well now he is suing the bowling it's alley called Spars a Bowling Alley. And the lawsuit is saying that they invited him I'm in Blue Smith to the venue and unfortunately the company failed to patrol the area and, and have police or guards on the premises and you know he's suing them because he suffered permanent and personal injuries this is what he's claiming that he suffered and he lost his ability to walk following the shooting and if you don't remember what happened you know he was standing next to his friend by their cars and then two unknown armed male suspects approached and him. And the suspects they tried to steal their gold chains and necklaces from baby and then they got into some type of physical altercation like a fight and stuff and baby then blue got shot in the shoulder and his friend was yelling for help and the suspects got away because the police got there after so the fact. So yeah yeah he might need that lawsuit money to pay that restitution and things he got going on well tell me what you think down in the comments below also subscribe to the channel for more updates give me a thumbs up share if you care and i'll talk to you guys later